Continuing coverage out of Beaufort County, News 3 has learned that Hilton Head Island High School principal Amanda Onan has been placed on administrative leave. The interim superintendent has decided to reopen the district's investigation into allegations of improper conduct. News 3's Shana Ferreira is joining us now with the latest on this investigation. Shana? Benantina school staff members were notified this afternoon and students and parents are being notified via email of this new change in the district's leadership. The Beaufort County School District confirmed it's once again investigating allegations that the Hilton Head Island High School principal Amanda Onand and a sheriff's deputy had sex on school grounds. She's been placed on administrative leave pending the outcome of that review. This case had been considered closed as far as the district was concerned until the Island Packet newspaper uncovered that the deputy, Dewan Holmes, made new admissions about the allegations during an internal affairs interview with the sheriff's office last year. We previously investigated these allegations back in 2016 and found no evidence of any wrongdoing. Um, but it's fair to say that uh, these latest revelations, uh, this testimony from the deputy, uh, resulted in uh, Dr. Burr's decision to reevaluate and reopen the investigation. In the interview obtained by the Island Packet through a public records request, Holmes admitted to investigators that he had an affair with Onan and had sexual relations with her on school grounds while he was on duty. The allegations originally came to light by Onan's then husband in 2016. Both Holmes and Onan denied the reports at the time. Holmes resigned from his position with the Beaufort County Sheriff's Office soon after, and that's why an internal affairs interview was not conducted. The board has also notified the State Board of Education about the allegations and requested the state level review. That's because the state board has the final say so when it comes to a South Carolina educator's certificate. Now, interim superintendent Herb Berg will make a decision about who will supervise the school during Onan's absence. News 3 will continue to monitor this developing story. Shana Ferreira, WSAV News 3. Shana,